Religious knowledge for Muslim youth turn back. Prayer. The importance of prayer. Of five pillars of Islam, the second one is to pray. The first task of the people is to believe in the existence and unity of Allah and the prophethood of the Prophet Muhammad PBUH. The most important of obligatory after faith is prayer. Five times prayer was assumed on the night of Marak one and a half years before the migration. Prayer is a worship that cleans the spirit, illuminates the heart and raises people to the presence of God. Our dear Prophet, prayer is the pillar of religion. 39, stated that prayer is a very important worship in our religion. Prayer is a light that gives us body and soul cleansing. In this way, the Muslim is purified from sin dirt and becomes a clean servant worthy of entering heaven. Our Prophet, PBUH, said. If any of you have a river in front of your door, and that person bathes in the river five times a day, will anything be left with dirt? Listeners. There is no dirt left, Razulela. They answered. Prophet Muhammad. Here is a five-time prayer like this, Allah clears sins by prayer. 40. He commanded. Prayer protects people from sin by placing the fear of Allah in the hearts. This fact is reported in the Quran as follows. Read the book that has been revealed to you, make the prayer straight. Real prayer will really prevent you from dreaming an evil. 41. As the Muslim person is obliged to perform prayers, he must teach his children to pray. Our beloved Prophet says, you order your children to pray at the age of 7. 42. If the mother and father teach their 7-year-old children to pray, they will get used to the prayer when they reach puberty. To whom is prayer? There are three conditions for a person to assume prayer. 1. Being a Muslim. 2. Having reached the age of puberty. 3. Be smart. Prayer times. There are five prayers a day. These are morning, afternoon, afternoon, evening and night prayers. Each of these prayers has certain times. It is imperative that each prayer is performed on its own time. It is not permissible to perform a prayer ahead of time, or to leave the prayer after the time without apology is a great sin. The following is stated in the Quran. Certainly, prayer is assumed at certain times on believers. 43. Time of morning prayer, it is the time from dawn to dawn until dawn rises. Time of lunch prayer, it is the time that lasts until one or two times the shadow of everything, from the time when the sun comes to our peak and the shadow begins to reach the east side, the shadow that exists when the sun is at the peak. Afternoon prayer time, it is the time from the end of the noon prayer until the sun goes down. The time of the evening prayer, it is the time that begins after the sun goes down until the redness disappears in the place where the sun goes down. The time of the yacht prayer, it is the time that begins after the time of the evening prayer comes out and continues until the time of the morning prayer has entered. Time of Vitiya prayer, the time of Vitiya prayer is also the time of the night prayer. However, the Witta prayer is performed only after the night is performed. Time of Friday prayer, it is the time of lunch prayer. The time of Tarawi prayer, it is the time of Yasa prayer. Time of the Eid prayer, Eid days are the time that begins after 50 minutes of sunrise in the morning and continues until the sun reaches its peak. Times not prayed. No prayer is performed at some times of the day. There are three times when it is not permissible to perform prayers. 1. At sunrise. 2. Before the sun reaches its peak and crosses the west side. 3. As the sun goes down. If the fard of the afternoon prayer of that day is not obeyed, it will be performed at sunset. Call to prayer. It is sunnah to read the prayer for five prayers and Friday prayers. Azan is an announcement announcing prayer times. With Azan, it is reported that both prayers will be performed and prayers will be instrumental in salvation. Prophecy of Muhammad PBUH is announced. Azan phrases are Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Eshedi en la ilaha illallah Eshedi en la ilaha illallah Eshedi en Muhammad en Rasulullah Eshedi en Muhammad en Rasulullah Hey ya al sala Hey ya al sala Hey ya al al fella Hey ya al al fella asterisk Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar La ilaha illallah Residence It is also a sunnah for men to bring residence in fard prayers Residence sentences are Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Eshedi en la ilaha illallah Eshedi en la ilaha illallah 
Eshedi and Muhammad and Razulullah. Eshedi and Muhammad and Razulullah. Hey yeah al Sala, hey yeah al Sala. Hey yeah al al Fila, hey yeah al al Fila. Had Kamadi Sala. Had Kamadi Sala. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Larilaha illala. Types of prayer. Prayers are three main types. 1. Fard prayers. 2. Vasav prayers. 3. Nafile prayers. Afard prayers. These are five time prayers and Friday and funeral prayers. Five times prayer. 1. Morning prayer. 4. Rakat. 2. Rakat sunnah. 2. Rakat fard. 2. Lunch prayer. 10. Rakat. 4. Rakat first sunnah. 4. Rakat fard. 2. Rakat last sunnah. 3. Afternoon prayer. 8. Rakat. 4. Rakat sunnah. 4. Rakat fard. 4. Evening prayer. 5. Rakat. 3. Rakat fard. 2. Rakat sunnah. 5. Yacht prayer. 10. Rakat. 4. Rakat first sunnah. 4. Rakat fard. 2. Rakat last sunnah. Prayers other than 5 times prayer. 1. Friday prayer. 10. Rakat. 4. Rakat first sunnah. 2. Rakat fard. 4. Rakat last sunnah. 2. Funeral prayer. Fars I kifade. B. Vasif prayers. 1. Vitiya prayer. 3. Rakat. 2. Ramadan feast prayer. 2. Rakat. 3. Eid al Adha prayer. 2. Rakat. C. Nafile prayers. Prayers that are performed other than Fard and Wajib are called Nafile prayers. Nafile prayers are divided into two. 1. Nafel prayers performed depending on Fard prayers. These are the circumcision prayers performed before and after the Fard, and the Tarawi prayer, which is a Mukhad circumcision performed during Ramadan nights. 2. Nafel prayers performed without being dependent on Fard prayers. These are also called must-have or mend-up prayers. These are prayers performed with the intention of gaining success in some times. Obligations of prayer. The obligatory prayers are 12. Six of them are outside prayer, they are called prayer conditions. All six are in prayer. These are called runes of prayer. In order for prayer to be authentic, 12 fard must be fulfilled completely. Conditions of prayer. 1. Taurus from Hades, to ablution the spiritual dirt called Hades, to make ablution and to make a rose when necessary. 2. Nekaset and Tahare, if there is dirt on the body of the person who will perform the prayer, on the clothes and where he will pray, to clean them. 3. Sedarai Avrit, it means that the person performing the prayer covers the places that should be covered in his body. Men, between the navel and the kneecap, including the kneecap. Women, they need to cover all parts of their body other than the face, hands and feet. 4. Istikbal i Qibla, to perform prayer by turning to Qibla. Qibla is the direction of the Kaaba, the holy building in the city of Mecca. Kaaba, H. said, Ibrahim and H. said, made by Ishmael. 5. Time, to perform prayers in their own time. It is not permissible to perform a prayer before the arrival. 6. Intention, to know which prayer he performed and to remember in his heart. It is circumcision to say the intention in language. The runes of prayer. 1. Slander takbir, it means taking a takbir when starting prayer. 2. Qiyam, it means standing in prayer. 3. Quran, to read some Quran while standing in prayer. 4. Ruku, the hands are inclined to reach the kneecap during prayer. 5. Sakud, it is to put the forehead with feet, knees and hands after Ruku. 6. Kada Ayahir, it means sitting enough to read Etihir to, at the end of the prayer. Prayers of Prayer. 1. To start prayer with the word, Allahu Akbar. 2. To read the time of Fatiha in the first two rakas of Fard prayers and in every rakah of futile prayers. 3. Reading the verse or verse after the Fatiha in the first two rakas of Fard prayers, in every rakah of Vitreous and Nafa prayers. 4. Reading the Fatiha before Surah. 5. Putting the nose on the floor with prostration. 6. Sitting in the second rakah of the three and four rakahs Buna Kada Ayula equals first sitting. 7. Reading Etiatu in the first sitting and the last sitting in the prayers. 8. When it is performed with the congregation, the Imam of the Imam in the morning, Friday, feast, Tarawi and Widow prayer, in the evening and night prayer, in the first two rakahs, secretly reading the conqueror and the duration of the Imam, in the afternoon and afternoon prayers. 9. The Imam's congregation should not read the Fatiha and Surah and keep quiet. 
10. Taking prayer of prayer and reading prayers of prayer in the prayer of Bitiya. 11. Additional takbir is taken during Eid prayers. 12. The man of Tardili, that is, standing straight, straight in the bow, women stand a little inclined, standing up straight from the bow, sitting between the two prostrations. 13. To greet left and right at the end of prayer. 14. If there is a mistake in prayer, to make a prostration. In the prayer, if something that is obligatory or wajib is delayed or if one of the wajibs is forgotten, it is necessary to make a prostration. If it is not done, prayer must be reopened. Things that disrupt prayer. 1. Talking during prayer. 2. Eating or drinking something. 3. Laugh as much as he hears himself. If he laughs as much as the ones he hears, his ablution will also be impaired. 4. Greet someone or take the greeting. 5. Turning your chest without wiggling. 6. Crying because of something of the world or a pain means, ah. Crying because a fear of Allah does not break prayer. 7. Trying to cough while there is no cough. Cough that is not available by hand does not break the prayer. 8. Trying to do a job in prayer. 9. Blowing on something. 10. Reading the Quran wrongly, meaning its meaning is broken. 11. Reading the verse by looking at mushaf because of 12. Oblivion.